Liz, as I said in the letter, and you know, it's not a secret, she's already been recognized in the community as, as being a, a influential leader in the community, but everything she does, she does with passion, enthusiasm, um, there's no, uh, there's no half-hearted effort when Liz does something, and I've admired her. I've admired her leadership of various organizations, but most importantly, she's a person who just doesn't sit on a board or an organization and just for the title or to be sitting in the chair, but she actually does things and gets things done, you know, is not one to just be a bystander, but really gets involved in the organization. Liz is a true leader in two senses of the word. First, she is visionary and knows where she wants an organization, where it, whether that's Education Quest or whether when she was president of Downtown Rotary or president of the Board of Directors of Leadership Lincoln, she knows where she wants an organization to go. But then she's the best kind of leader because not only does she set out the vision, but she follows through and makes sure that it happens by doing the hard work of follow up and inspiring people to follow her direction and lead. Liz is an amazing mother. I've gotten to know her children and she an amazing grandmother and she cares deeply and first and foremost about her family. And uh, she's a wonderful wife to Ken and a wonderful mother to her kids and, and grandmother and that's her number one priority and that has a lot to do with her success as a business person. All I can say is thank you. It's certainly an honor. It's always nice to be recognized when you have put a lot of work into something. I've always been a strong believer in public recognition to the people that deserve it. Uh, myself, not necessarily included, but when we would put together events and things for Leadership Lincoln, one of the items always was, and when and where are we gonna thank the board and acknowledge committee chairs and, and their respective committee, what have you, um, in whatever setting that was appropriate. You, public acknowledgement of some good work and um, passion and, and people putting their heart into something is, is always uh, necessary, but at the same time, when you are on the receiving end, it's always very humbling. And um, all I can say is thank you, and thanks to Mick. He's an awesome guy. And thanks to Ken for putting up with everything.